it's now time for another round of quick tips. This time from Dean at Wortley Hydroponics in Leeds. Humidity can be a massive issue, especially in the summer months. I would recommend something like this, a simple humidifier, which will pump a lot more moisture into your air and your leaves won't tend to kill, especially in the summer months when they can, they can suffer a lot. It'll also help nutrient uptake and your plants will thrive. This is fully adjustable, so you can adjust uh, the humidity that you want in, into the grow room at any time. Uh, just simply fill it with plain water, a nice stream of gentle mist gives your plants everything they need to thrive. Silicon, a massive part of a plant's development, often overlooked. I find there's many silicons on the market today. They can decrease and increase your pH. Obviously, you can control that with pH up and down. But in my opinion, Hygiene's Budlink Silicon is the best on the market today. It will increase your nutrient uptake, also protect against dehydration and disease, and will strengthen your cell walls. I would strongly recommend any sort of trace mix on the market today. People often are too quick to rush to these products when the plants are poorly. If you use these products from the start to the end, you will maximise the plant's potential and also keep it lush and green. To flush or not to flush? I would recommend using any sort of flush to get rid of the excess salts in your plants. People tend to use water. However, there is no nutrition in pure water where the flushes contain a little bit of nutrient at this critical late flowering stage. Rooting stimulators. I would always recommend to use one throughout the whole of the plant's life. People often look at leaves and see deficiencies, but it could be down to the root system. Use any root stim on the market today. You'll see a healthy, vigorous root growth and minimum deficiencies. People often ask me, can they not just use a weak version of their A and B as a plant start feed? But I'd always suggest you use a specifically designed nutrient for the plant's early growth phase, which is higher in boron. 